Large language models are known to encode a wealth of knowledge about the physics of our world. However, such knowledge can be wrong or not aligned with the dynamics of an environment. How to mitigate this? The task of aligning this knowledge with an environment is referred to as functional grounding. Formally, functional grounding can be described as learning to use symbols in a way that enables to solve tasks in an environment. This includes aligning symbols processing with the underlying dynamics or physics of the environment. We achieve this grounding by giving tasks to the LLM and enabling it to interact with the environment, make causal intervention, get feedback and update using online reinforcement learning algorithms. There are many open questions to understand better how such functional grounding works. We believe one needs to start by making systematic experiments in simple, well-controlled environments. Thus, we conduct our experiments with baby AI text, a textual grid wall in which the agent navigates in order to achieve different goals within the environment. An example of a task could be go to the blue ball in a room that includes distractor objects such as a key or a box. In our work, we use an LLM to act as the agent's policy. It takes as input a textual description of both the goal and the observation given by the environment and scores the possible actions. The agent then selects an action according to the LLM output and receives the reward. This reward is used to fine-tune the underlying LLM using PPO. This process is done in an online manner. Updates and interaction with the environment are done incrementally. We use Flanty 5 Large as the pre-trained LLM. We provide evidence that leveraging the knowledge learned by the foundation model during its pre-training allows our agent to achieve a better sample efficiency than other baselines. We also demonstrate that our LLM-powered agent has strong generalization capabilities. For instance, it is still able to perform well even after changing the name of the object present within the environment. These generalization capabilities suggest that the agent has functionally grounded the symbols that describe the geometry of the environment. Many more studies are done in the paper.